Hey Plenty friends, welcome back to another new video. So today, as y'all can see, it is literally early in the morning. I could not sleep. So last night, I ended up telling you guys on Instagram and on YouTube about my Etsy store. And it was, I was a little bit nerve-wracking because I was like, I don't know. <laughs> and um, we ended up getting, I ended up getting my first order and I was just like so shocked. I was like, oh my God, like what, this is crazy. <laughs> And then, uh, which ended up getting like the bundle thing, like the six husband cutting bundles, which I knew was gonna do amazing. And also the other one, the mystery box. And then I ended up taking a shower and I was taking a shower. I heard like the sound again. I was like, oh my God. And then it was a, a subscriber and it's her birthday. So I'm gonna give her some little extra on her little package. And I was like, oh my God, now there's two orders. And I, I just, I, I was so excited. I was with my mom and my brothers. And I was like, oh my God, this is crazy. Like, it's just crazy. And I know it's just an order, but for me, like, it's not about like, how much I'm, I'm making because it's not even that much. But it's just the fact that people want to buy my plants, like my cuttings, and it's just, it, 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 it's just, it's cray cray. Like, it's crazy. Like, my babies are going to be, like, shared across the United States, and they're going to get new owners. And someone else is going to, like, it's going to make their day, and it's just going to make them super, super happy. And that's just, that's what makes me super, super excited. <laughs> and then I woke up. I like got four in the morning or five and then i saw i got two more orders and i was like oh my god so right now we have two orders i'm doing it their little boxes right now i also i'm looking at, i'm not gonna show their address but i'm looking at the computer i'm putting up their address and their names i also have the list of the plants that i'm gonna go and cut right now some are already rooted and sphagnum moss ended up finding a way to actually shipping out plants correctly and also the giveaway people i think they should get their plants today or tomorrow for sure tomorrow i didn't ship i didn't get them their um their tracking numbers because i lost their ac but they should be getting the packages if you're watching and you're gonna get your package on uh, the october 14 or the october 15 for sure if not please send me a message so and i'm gonna send a dm on the 15 if or well, the 15 and 16 like if they got their package and if not then i'm gonna go investigate on what's going on um try to find that receipt I really don't know. I was just, these past weeks have been so crazy, which is why I'm posting so many plant shopping videos right now because there's just so much going on and I gotta keep posting content on YouTube. If you post daily and you stick with that, like, you know, content idea, like posting daily, you gotta stick with it because YouTube starts um, seeing your, um, my head looks like, I look like a damn bird. Um, <laughs> YouTube starts seeing your channel as like daily content about the algorithm. And then once you don't post, it messes you up really, really bad. So I gotta keep pumping up content for YouTube. I'm trying to put content for Instagram and then Instagram Reels and then TikTok and then I'm doing this which this is the most exciting thing out of everything because it's like a small little business it's so cute like oh my god I'm actually so happy <laughs> already so I just got all the cuttings that I needed we got some neon potos now this was not part of the order but I was gonna give some what do you call it string of hearts as like a thank you for being like you know my first um people that buying plants from my Etsy shop but I decided like the most that I put was like more fun and more exciting so this should make them a lot more excited and happier <laughs> hopefully so I got this as a gift and then we got the other ones as an order as I was in the restroom somebody else placed an order and she ended up wanting to swap some of the plants so she didn't want a Brazil or a Neon Potos because she already had it and she wanted to replace them with Mikans so yeah and yes it's showing the names but I don't think it minds, like they're just literally names, like you don't even know who like these people are, like they could be like millions of Elizabeths. Um, so yeah, we got this, I don't know, I don't, I don't know why people get all weirded out over names, like there's, they could, it could say David, it could say Mark, nobody really knows who they are. Anyways, and then we got this, <sighs> okay, I gotta like, make sure the address is not showing, um, because I thought that was like the box, but this is one of the one of the ones that I messed up on. The Ankis, this side is like the other packages. But over here we have the Mycans and the Seba Blues. These have already been rooted in this container for like a week already. And I, I, I made sure I listed like some of them will be rooted and others will be fresh cuttings. As you can see, those are fresh cuttings. And then over here we have the rooted ones. So all of these are in here are really, really good in roots. Um, we have the micans and then we have some stable blues so yes I'm just wondering if I should put like because the way I was gonna wrap the fresh cutting so that's seen like a lot of um, videos the way they, they do it they um, wrap the node with a moist paper towel and then they wrap the paper towel with plastic um, but since these are in some sphagnum moss I'm debating if I should just pull it out like that 
and then wrap it with a moist paper towel and then wrap it in plastic to keep the moisture or I should add the sphagnum moss in it and I think I'm just gonna add I'm not gonna like leave sphagnum moss in it so yes that's basically it. I'm gonna go and finish this up I'm gonna go and cut these by nodes and then get the packagings ready and I'll give I'll show you guys when I have one package complete I was about to go on to the next box, but I forgot to keep you guys updated. So let me go and open this again. It's just like by a sticky thing. I'm gonna go and tape it so to secure the package. Oh my god, this is like not even a this is really <laughs> Oh my god. Okay. So this is what they're gonna see. It's kinda hard to do with one hand. Okay. Little thank you notes. And then their cuttings. I was gonna tip it in the box, but there's literally no room. Like everything just crazy. So I ended up adding some stuffing to keep everything like safe and in place. And then that's basically it. And there's a little monster of Peru. <laughs> I kind of love the packaging. Now it is a little bit very cheap. Yeah, I'm just starting. I would love to like make some cuter thank you notes, but as of now, this is all I got. Um, I think it's kind of cute, it's like kind of personal, but um, yeah, so that's basically it. Now I gotta go do the next ones and then go to the USP USPS office and ship them out. Alrighty guys, so it's already been four hours of packaging all of these boxes. And now I'm doing the last one. This lady wanted to swap the neon potos in Brazil's to Mikan's. So I added, so she's gonna get three Mikan's, but I ended up adding like four or five in here. And then she wanted the which the bundle, which is uh, um, potos enjoy, the Cebu blue. I ended up adding two because why not? And then I added a, um, what do you call this one? The Snow Queen potos. And then, as a little thank you, all of my packages, all of these, are getting a free Monstera Peru cutting as a huge thank you for the support. And that's basically it. So I'm gonna go and write a thank you note and then package them up and then go to the post office and ship them out and then let them know, give them the tracking number and just wait. Also, somebody ended up, one of y'all ended up sending me a DM I ended up going live on Instagram while I was packaging all of these packages just to get some company and one of y'all that won the Super Blue giveaway ended up messaging me letting me know that you guys got the Super Blue and I was like oh my god let me know how it came out like how is it he sent me pictures and it looks great so I am pretty confident now on my shipping super duper duper excited I just needed that one person to let me know everything was okay since everything's repetitive except these are also going to be these are fresh cutting. Some of them have been rooting and spank them off, but majority of them have been fresh cuts and I ended up wrapping them in a moist paper, hand paper towel and then wrapped in plastic to keep that moisture in there. And yeah, and also I'm not taping these in the box since if there is no space. I'm adding just some filling inside and then putting the cuttings on top, the thank you notes, no, the cuttings on top of the filling and then I add more filling on top and then the thank you note and then I close it to make sure everything stays in place. So they will be moving around, but they have like some cushioned room. And that's basically it. I am super duper duper excited to see how they come out and just gonna go and wait for those reviews and hopefully everything comes out good and hope they are happy with their purchase. Um, I'm just super duper excited for this new journey and thank you so much for everybody that's been supporting me. So yeah, I will keep you guys updated with what's gonna go on next. <laughs> Alrighty, so everything's already in the little container. Just thank you notes. I'm gonna go and close it. So I'm gonna go do it quick, y'all. I'm gonna do it upside down to see if I can do it. This, and then close it from here. And I'm checking on the camera if everything's looking good inside, which it does. And then, uh, let's see, close this guy. <laughs> I'm gonna go and take off the sticker now. And then close it. And this is the last package. I'm super duper excited. I'm gonna go and tape it because I gotta go and secure it, even though it has like a little seal. But I wanna make sure that the package is actually really good and secure. And then I'm gonna put it in the stack. And now all of these boxes need to go and get taped. And that's basically, I'm gonna go to the post office, ship them out, and then you just hope for the best. <laughs> <laughs>
Alrighty, plants and friends. So that is it. I know I didn't take you guys to the U USPS or stuff like that, but I just went and dropped off the packages. It came out like four to six dollars for shipping all of them. And then I came back home, I got the receipt, which has the shipping addresses, the, I mean, the tracking numbers. I gave them to Etsy and Etsy's gonna go and give them to the buyers. And that's basically it. At this point, it's just a waiting game and seeing what they think about the packages. So I'm super duper, duper excited. And yeah, that's basically it. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. I'm also going to be adding, I'm gonna try to add new listings every single day in the Etsy shop. I'm gonna add some Super Blues, I mean, Super Blues. I'm gonna add some string of hearts um, today. So yeah, and tomorrow, maybe some Brazils or your Mikan's bundle, something like that. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Let me know if you wanna see more videos like this one. It was pretty fun to film and all that good jazzy stuff. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.